Hey, um, I'm having this problem with my NXT at the moment. I'm not quite sure what it is that's causing the problem. Um, but yeah, I'll show you. Start up as normal. Immediately to that screen. Okay, I've, I've cleaned the buttons. I've I've tried what Steve has said um, on the forums. You know, wriggle a button around. Um, you now cannot do anything and eventually it just turns itself off again. The power's fine, I'll prove that to you. Plug the power in. So well, it is now, but um I mean it literally just gone off fully charged and the power here says that's fine. So I'll turn this off. And the only way to turn it off now you can't none of the buttons work. But interestingly, um, as I've said on the forums, um, it's oh, it's gone. Um, you find that um, you can run programs if you have the brick plugged in and it's on this funny, well, on this turn-off screen that you can't do anything. Um, I've also found oh, turn itself off already. Um, if you if you turn it on, well, that's fine. You can. Sometimes you have to pull the battery out to get it to turn off. If you hold, turn it on, holding down this one, it will go to the main menu, but you still can't do anything and it just turns itself off again. Um, if you've got any ideas, please please put a link on this video in the comments or something, or any any thoughts or help would be great because. And this has just suddenly happened, it's not like it's gradually sort of sometimes happened, it just suddenly sprung up. Um, I am using the rechargeable battery. It has, has the same problem with normal normal batteries. Um, and the same points as I put on the forum. I'll, I'll put a link to that on this video if you could help then. Yeah, that'd be great. But, I mean, look, this, this icon is still going around so it's not frozen. I've tried the hard reset. You probably won't be able to see it in there. There we go. You see the button? I've tried that. The button that's underneath in in uh, inside the battery area, obviously that's not the reset button. The voltage and on the battery is everything. It's fine. There's nothing wrong with that, obviously. But I've pretty much run out of options. Um, I'm going to have to probably end up talking to the technical team or something. But I have no idea. I've re reinstalled the soft the firmware on here about five different times. Same firmware. Um, and it just but the buttons do work they they work sometimes in programs but they don't I, I have no idea what's going on so if you could help that would be great um, thanks for watching and please post a comment if you have any ideas because I'm stuck bye